Hello, my name is Jürgen Köhler. I'm a keyboard player from Frankfurt, Germany. And today I'm going to show you um, how to set up a main stage uh, on my MacBook Pro. So that's a program um, for using uh, on live uh, performances. Um, it provides all the keyboard sounds you need. You can use samples, playbacks, um, all the effects, everything's possible. Um, all the audio unit plugins can be used, um, instruments as well as effects. So today we're going to start with a very little, very small setup. For example, if you want to fly with a plane to a gig um, and you are not able to carry all your stuff with you, your keyboards, then you can use main stage in this setup. So um, I got this MacBook Pro. I'm using this sound card, M Audio M Track Hub, and um, a very small keyboard. This is called uh, Micro Cork from Cork, and maybe that's too small for a gig, but uh, for today that's enough. Everything's USB powered. Um, I don't need, I don't even need um, a power plug. So for a short gig, uh, that's quite enough for that MacBook. And um, MacBook uh, gives all the power to the to the sound card and to the keyboard. So first, I connect uh, my sound card to the computer. Then I connect my keyboard to the computer. And now I need to plug in um, the whole system to my sound system in the studio. So I use the outputs on this sound card. And now, now I can start main stage. Here we go. And uh, for um, that demonstration, I just load um, a keyboard concert. Um, so this thing is called concert um, in main stage. So that's the whole setup and um, including different sounds. I take that one um, provided by a main stage Apple. This is a small setup with an electric piano. There it is. Now I. Um, should tell Mainstage that we use this sound card, this M track. So I go to Preferences, Audio, and I say Output, and it's already there. Um, it's the M track hub, it's my audio output. All right. Now I have to go to Layout, to the Rider Layout and tell this keyboard on the screen that I use that keyboard for real. So I mark that keyboard on the screen, MIDI port, all MIDI ports, so that's fine. I can even choose this uh, micro, cork, micro key. I go back to edit and now I'll try it, it works. Perfect. So um, that's all you need if uh, you got um, just that little setup and you got tons of sounds uh, possible in that setup. Uh, you may just change the instrument and I will tell you that in the next tutorial how to change the instrument and um, get an, an, another sound. So thanks um, for watching this and stay tuned for the next tutorials.